All right, for this lesson today, you're going to need your straight needles. They'll look like this with the caps on one end. And I'm using a size 9 in bamboo. And then you're going to need your worsted weight yarn. I'm using Vanna's Choice 100% acrylic. Now, if you have a skein of yarn that looks like this, um, you're going to want to pull out the end that goes from the inside. On a ball, any ball of yarn, you have the end that comes from the outside and the end that comes from the inside. If you pull from the center, it's a center pull. So the way you find the right end is to see the strand of yarn that's going into the center. This is the end that wraps around the outside of the yarn. So you're gonna pull that out so that you don't grab the wrong piece. And mine has already been pulled out, but what you're gonna do is on the opposite end, you're going to reach inside your ball of yarn and just pull out some of the center. And relatively quickly, you should find the end that comes from the center of your yarn. What this does is you don't have to rip off your label, but also your ball of yarn isn't gonna be flopping around as you try to pull the yarn from the outside. It's gonna very effortlessly pull from the inside of the yarn and you'll find that that'll be a lot easier to work with. Okay, to start, we're gonna learn how to do a slip knot. Now, to do a slip knot, there's a lot of different ways to do it, but I'm gonna try and make it as easy to understand as possible. The end is going to be on the left, the yarn wraps around, your left hand. You're going to grab both strands with your right hand, twist the loop to create that X, and you're going to reach through the loop and grab the right hand strand, which is the longer strand that goes into your ball of yarn. That way, when you pull that strand tight, your loop will tighten. Then what you're going to do is take your first needle slide it through the loop and pull it tight. Now you're ready to cast on.